at the last couple of days? How would you characterize them? Um, I mean, there's a lot of disparate kind of descriptions. People saying the ANC at war with itself. This is a, a the contestation around uh, the, the the terminology on the strategy and tactics documents. How would you characterize it for yourself as as the ANC? I would characterize it as people at work, not at war. Uh, as you will know, even when we were in commissions. Mm -hmm. We did not see any people as it is normally the case in ANC conferences. Mm -hmm. You'll be in commissions and other people get time to go shopping and do other things. But in this instance, people were in commissions and they were making serious inputs in the commissions. They were very robust, which is one characterization of the ANC we were very robust. Robustness doesn't mean that we're at war with ourselves. Mm -hmm. It means that we want to do things better, smarter, and deliver better to our people. So that's what characterized the three days. Uh, but of course, the president did set the tone that at the end of these four days, we must come up with radical empowering policies that will change the socio-economic landscape of South Africa. Mm -hmm. We cannot continue to have people who live in poverty, people who are unemployed and unemployable, and we cannot continue to have a society that is and equal. Okay. So these are the three that issues that are dealing with, and within that, delegates have indeed dealt with those issues uh, in a manner that is satisfactory. So where are we? Is it the second phase of the transition? Is it the second transition? What is coming out? Well, I, I hope you have been in South Africa in the past three days for you. Mm -hmm. we, 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 we authored a document and it was titled The Second Transition. The delegates have said, uh, your characterization of the phase we're in might not be that correct. We think our view is that we are in a seamless transition to a society uh, that is democratic. So uh, what is that? There's no second transition. The transition mm -hmm. that we are talking about now is a phase, is a new phase, is a second phase of this transition to this uh, democratic society. And that phase mm -hmm. includes serious radical policy shifts that will ensure that we change the socio-economic landscape of South Africa. That's what we are talking about. Okay. And indeed, the ANC has been very good at theoretical conceptualizing any phase that we are in. Even in this instance, we have spot on said that we need to say this phase, which we call it the second phase in the transition towards a national democratic society. Mm -hmm. This phase must be characterized by radical policies yeah. that will change the economics of this country and also the social the, the, the social inequalities yes. in this country. Now, earlier on, we had uh, Magdalene Munsami from the ANC Youth League, and she was saying that a lot of the discourse now is steeped in the documents of uh, the strategy and, docu uh, and, and tactics document of 2000. We are talking about that. Do you agree with we, that? We, we are in full agreement. Yeah. In, in fact, this is saying how do we implement elements of the strategy and tactics. Mm -hmm. so, indeed. Yeah. Is the strategy and tactics of 2007 okay. that is still a guiding document what for does the ANC. this mean does this mean in the in the period the intervening period yeah. the ANC has not been successful in implementing strategy and tactics 2007 no okay it, it means that you see at every uh, at every stage mm -hmm. we look and pause and say what are things that we need to do differently okay so that's what we have said here yeah that if you look at the reality of South Africa, and indeed this reality is also captured in the strategy and tactics of 2007, by the way, mm -hmm. we are then saying, what are these things that we then need to do differently and sharply in the implementation of the strategy and tactics? Okay. So we are not doing this outside the strategy and tactics. Of we're saying this is a, of 2007, yeah. yes. Okay. We don't have a new strategy and tactics. Okay, yes. let's talk a little bit about some of the things that are coming through. There are reports that the ANC now wants six provinces. Is that uh, what is coming out of one of the commissions now? No, no, no. You see, the, 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 the Commission on Legislature and Governance has not reported. There's never been a report before plenary. Therefore, these are speculations, and uh, I don't think that we should uh, 
direct ourselves to talking about speculations. Okay. We will have a report from the legislature and governance, and that report will also be made available to the media today, as we have made other reports available. Okay. This is speculation. A speculation. Is this an idea, though, that was being mooted? I'm saying this is speculation. We will have a report yes. from the legislature and governance. Mm -hmm. That, that 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 commission dealt with you know you remember we, we had four provinces at some stage yeah. in south africa yeah and uh, during the codessa negotiations there was a compromise yeah that created nine provinces therefore there is nothing wrong with the anc discussing yes that's why i'm asking Do, are we having value no, yeah. no let's not talk about the number mm -hmm. having nine provinces is it adding value should we have 12 mm -hmm. should we have 50 should we have one mm -hmm. or should we have no problem? That is a discussion. Okay. Uh, that is was there in the commissions. We okay. don't have a report now. About we will have a The same applies to municipalities as well. Okay. The number of municipalities, including those that are not sustainable, yes. is it assisting us to deliver services to our people? Okay. So that commission will report to plenary and will bring that report Later on to, to, to All you. Right. So what happens today? Today we will be having, since plenary is sitting now, mm -hmm. The commissions that have not reported yesterday will be reporting to plenary. Okay. Amongst those commissions is a very important commission on legislature and governance, the one that talks about provinces and the municipalities. Yes. Okay. One, the other one is on gender. We cannot continue to have discrimination against our women in this country. Okay. Even in the private sector and in the in the public sector, we will hear what the, the gender commission suggests. Okay. Thirdly, economic transformation including the state intervention in the mining sector what is the anc take on the economy of this country that excludes the majority of people of this country what is our take on That's this also going amongst to be others on today. so these are okay. some of the commissions that we will be reporting right. there's so much to, to talk about jackson thank you very much for coming in to talk to us this morning thank you, thank you very, very much, much. Okay.